Errors 1 to 5 UV light meter is composed of the host and probe. Nine probes can be selected. Five probes for measuring UVA. Two of them are used to measure high pressure mercury lamp. Three of them are used to measure LED light sources. One probe for measuring UVB. Three probes for measuring UVC. One of the UVC probe is used to measure LED light source. Two of the UVC probes are used to measure low pressure mercury lamp. Nine probes have the same operation method. Next, we'll demonstrate the operation method using UVA LED X0 probe. The host and probes are connected by an aviation plug. Now we connect the probe to the host, align the probe to the interface, rotate to the right position, plug in the probe and the connection is complete. If you want to remove the probe, pull up the socket gently, the probe is taken out. Don't pull out the probe violently. After connecting the probe, the probe model is recognized. You can start the measurement. We can use an UV flashlight to simulate the UV light source for demonstration. You radiate the UV light source onto the probe. The small round hole on the probe is a receiver. When it receives the UV light, test result will be displayed on the screen. P means the maximum power. E means accumulated energy. The longer the measurement time, the greater the energy. If the backlight is off during the measurement, press the hold button to turn on the backlight. We can see the maximum, minimum, and average power values in the upper left corner. This is the measurement duration. The measurement duration is about 40 seconds. Then press the hold button with the backlight on to lock the data. Data will not change after locking. At this time, if you move the light source away or turn off, data is still displayed on the screen. If you need to clear the data, restart the measurement. Just press the hold button. During the measurement, if you want to clear the data, press this button to clear the data. The above is the operation method of LS125 UV light meter.